Hello and welcome to another video everybody. Today in a slightly different setting. I actually wanted to resume making videos now that my mood has gone up, that I'm feeling better because I guess like many of you I have been feeling quite down in the last two months. And so today I'm back with my little Nabi over here. She was made by my friend Maria, who is also known as Poison Girl Dolls. One of the greatest Pulip artists. She, yeah, look at that face. I mean, come on. <laughs> I love my little Nabi. You can see she has those brown golden eyes and the cutest face up ever so what I wanted to share with you was I have Nabi here with me in her oversized weekend look you can see that she's wearing Pulip Noan Travas Tokyo oversized shirt and Atelier Mila Brock's distressed embroidered pants and some cute booties by a cool cat because it is Sunday and it is the weekend. But also I brought lots of outfits with me so I guess that I am going to film her in her various outfits and I'm also going to show you what I have brought with me. Also if you're wondering what she is sitting on after lots and lots of trying to defy gravity. I also brought two of my Aeson dolls with me. Here we have Alice's Tea Party Noah and Alice's Tea Party Riley who I haven't officially unboxed yet. I'm going to take a picture of Miss Nabi in her awesome weekend gear right now. And afterwards I'm going to show you all the clothes that I brought with her and I will redress her. So see you in a bit. And welcome back. So <laughs> can you see all of the good things that I brought with me? Honestly I just kept adding everything into my, into my bag. And so this is what I decided on. <laughs> I guess those are way more outfits and options than I would probably need for a week. But at the same time, I do like to be more flexible with my styling choices because it helps you get more creative. So I'm going to quickly show you what I brought with me and also mention the creators. So over here you can see that there is this blue kitten theme with two headpieces. So basically this blue dress with the blue kitty apron, the blue ribbon or bow and the kitty hat is all from La Princesa Yukichiro on Etsy and she also made this really pretty petticoat so yeah that you get more floof with your outfit and then of course you need some tights so I got these fishnet tights, these hot pink tights, the minty ones and like a classic white as well as the these kitty tights over here and the Travers Pulip Noan um, socks and also her garter and her necklace. I basically brought all of Pulip Noan stock with me. So here you also have her little shorts and her awesome hoodie. And then I, of course, also had to get, had to take her fierce boots with me. And they are next to this one piece Perona hat, which is a 
clip on so I think that this will look really nice with pull-up optical queen skirt and maybe a simple black and white striped tee which was made by Sukidos also on Etsy who also made these cute mini mouse ears you can actually also take the bow off so it's just mouse ears or mickey mouse ears and from suki i also brought this little number which has this cute minty vest as well so yeah <laughs> i i brought lots of suki with me as well as some Atelier Mila Brock and Nabi is also wearing jeans of hers right now like re she makes really really great dolly denim but also beautiful dresses as well and I had kind of also planned out uh, a bear theme so I got this head from Dr. Rabbit Land, and I think that this sweater from Nenel et La Lui will also look really nice with it. And if you're asking yourself, okay, now you have a kitty head, now you have a bear head, and there's also a bunny head, yeah, that's for when I'm going to unbox my ASON dolls so I'm going to use it for that then. Since it's spring I also wanted to bring some spring themed dresses with me. So on the right you have the Secret Garden of White Witch which is dress I should say. So here it is, it is really pretty and floral and I also brought Pulifunashi's classical Lolita look with me. Almost everything I didn't bring her blouse but that's okay because I brought her bonnet and I also brought the little cute Funashi bag so she is always going to have a friend. And I also Got this cute little corduroy dress, corduroy halter dress and this crop top to go with it which I got when I bought my custom pulled Claire from Kita Sin. And yeah, what is left I guess we have some simple red bottom Mary Janes which were part of a groove outfit selection clothes pack for Pulip. Then I got Pulip Kiyomi mint ice cream version slippers for relaxing. I got Pulip Tomoe Mami's I guess corset. I think <laughs> this was like a last minute decision. So I think it might it might look it it depends whether the dark brown clashes too much with the black but I thought maybe you know make a monochrome outfit the belt in the middle and then this hat on top we will see how it looks because as you know I'm going to take you on this journey with me so this is all I brought for my Pulip Nabi Oh, here we go. <laughs> I think she looks adorable. I think that actually the the harness, I guess it's a harness from Tomoe Mami looks pretty good with the black and white. And I was thinking about maybe also putting this into to tuck it into the skirt. But at the same time, I think it has something more playful if it's sticking out on the sides. So here is the whole look. Thank you. 
Hello and <laughs> welcome to another day everybody. Today is Monday and so it's time to give little Nabi another another outfit once more. So I decided that she will go full on kitten with the La Princesa Yukichiro outfit. So let's go! Oh, isn't she the cutest kitten? Hello and happy Tuesday everybody. Actually today the weather was looking pretty bleak and so I thought that I could be lazy and not film anything. But it actually cleared up and is looking really really nice now. So today I was thinking that she should probably wear something super comfy that she can be a little rascal. I think while redressing my dolls I always find such nice details. For example, she is now going to wear an outfit by Suki Dolls and look how neatly lined it is inside with this cute little polka dot fabric. And I also saw that La Princesa Yukichiro's outfit has some lace on the inside over here. So here we have my little bunny. She is wearing this absolutely cute outfit by Suki Dolls with some hot pink tights and it's slippers, it's slippers. So she's wearing Kiyomi slippers. I'm thinking about maybe adding this vest because I really, I really like it. Hello and welcome to another day. You might be wondering <laughs> what happened since the last time you saw this little girl and basically it was Murakami's Heartbolt Wonderland and the end of the world. So yeah, <laughs> I got completely sucked in to the story but woohoo, it's time for another outfit. So today we are completely going full Pulip Funashi. I have to say now that I also own BJDs and Smart Dolls, it's a little bit unusual for me that you do not, um, how can you say, that you do not take off the head of your doll. And we're back. Holy moly, this needed lots of tweaking. <laughs> Because the blouse kind of, I guess the material is thicker than the stock blouse. Good morning. Good morning. It's our last day here. As you can see, Oh, sorry. I brought too many dolls with me. Those two babies haven't been unboxed, so yeah, I guess we have something to look forward to, won't we? Nabi-chan. So today, since we are going to be needing a comfy outfit to travel for a bit, I decided that it would be the best to go back to one of my favorites, this Atelier Miller Brock Clyde. <laughs> Sorry for the German dress is one of my absolute favorites. And I think it would look really nice with this Dr. Rabbit hat. Yay! We're ready for a photo, Snabby Chan. Or as Sanji from One Piece would say, Nabi Chuan. 
So let's go take some pics. Here she is, my little butterfly. I want to thank you so much for watching this video. Please like and subscribe if you'd like to see more of my content. And yeah, what else can I say then? Have a lovely day. I hope you stay safe and bye bye.